What's up guys, this is KH Unlimited and today I have another video for you guys and this is actually a video which I haven't really done on this channel and basically what it is, it is a discussion video. So you guys have noticed that other channels have done this which is basically talking about a certain topic and basically they'll be talking about it for a while and giving their own opinions on the topic and I really want to do this for like a few reasons. One being is in my videos I don't really get to give my opinion on a lot of topics because when I make news videos I basically tell you what happens and that's basically all um, for the most part I only get to give a little of my opinion but with these type of videos I can give a lot of my opinions and the best part is you guys my commenters and my viewers can start discussions in the comments with other of my viewers so you guys could have a discussion too which will be pretty awesome so you guys could interact together so that's why I really like uh, I want to start doing discussion videos and another reason is since it is a discussion video, I don't really have to edit this video. So what you hear, what I say, whatever mistakes I make, you guys are going to hear. So it'll be pretty much easier for me. And the best reason is that I'm going to be able to get it out faster for you because I'm not really going to be having to edit my audio. So now that we're done with that, let's start with this discussion video. So the topic for this discussion is Kingdom Hearts Key being canon. So if you guys didn't know yet, a few days ago I put out a video about a Kingdom Hearts interview by Tai Yusui. So he was interviewed by Mary Station actually and he gave a lot of information. Now, I'm sorry if you hear that so watch. It's one of the things that I was talking about uh, me not editing it. Uh, so basically he was interviewed and he gave some new bits of information. That video I primarily talked about my opinion on frozen and being like Atlantica of how it's gonna have singing elements like it and I kind of ranted there but I didn't really talk about other stuff in the interview which was kind of stupid of me but like I said it is a news video so I shouldn't really be giving my opinions too much so which is why the discussion videos are here for so one of the new bits of information that they just gave us in the interview was that Kingdom Hearts Key is now canon so if you don't know what canon means, it basically means that Kingdom Hearts Key is now relevant to the Kingdom Hearts plot, the overall plot. So if you really want to understand Kingdom Hearts 3, we are going to have to know what happens in Kingdom Hearts Key. So a lot of people are pissed about this, but it wouldn't be so bad because we get to play it, right? No, we don't. Because in that same interview, Taiyu Sui said that anytime soon, Kingdom Hearts Key is not coming to the West. It basically means right now it is just a Japan exclusive. So this is basically the main topic for this video and me talking about this and giving my opinions on it so this may be kind of like a rant video because it is kind of stupid what's happening since in the same interview he said it's not coming in the west but it's okay it is just canon so you don't have to worry about it which we do because especially for us Kingdom Hearts youtubers we really like to know every single thing about Kingdom Hearts every detail and speculate upon it and we like to know everything that we can learn about Kingdom Hearts not only so we know but we could report it to you guys so we could tell you and you guys can understand from us if you get most of your information for us so if we can't get the information how will you guys get it and how will the rest of the West get it because we're not getting the game at all and now that it's canon it's really gonna affect us because we're missing out on parts of the story that we might need for Kingdom Hearts 3. One of the pieces of information were about the foretellers and we didn't know that but the only reason it found out was because of a few translations. So how about if there's more information like that but even more important. It's not like we're gonna find out. So that's the thing I'm talking about. I don't know why they would make a canon especially if it's not coming to the west. The best move they could have made of was to announce that it's coming to the west maybe a few days after or the same day say it was canon. Not only would that be a better strategy that would actually uh, pump more ki uh, Western Kingdom Hearts players to play the game because now that they know it's relevant to the overall Kingdom Hearts plot, especially Kingdom Hearts 3, they will play it and that would get them a lot more players. And that would be a smart strategy, so I don't know why they didn't think of that. So, in my opinion, I think it was a, a re really big mistake that they announced that it was being canon. Even if it was canon for now, I don't think they should have announced it unless um, they announced the game as a Western release. So. We don't know when it's going to get released. Taiyusei said himself that he doesn't think it's anytime soon. In my opinion, I think it may come next year. Because as you guys probably know, I strongly believe that Kingdom Hearts 3 isn't going to come next year. If anything, it's going to come really, really late 2015 or early 2016. And as you know, Square Enix has been releasing a Kingdom Hearts game every year since about 2010 or 2009 and they haven't missed a year since so what i think could be happening is in 2015 either kingdom Hearts key will get a western release or if it's not that it should either be kingdom hearts dream drop distance having an hd re-release and in that same interview taiyusui already said that he wouldn't be doing a release of kingdom hearts dream drop distance in hd anytime soon since it is a pretty recent title so we can already cross that out but he also said that kingdom hearts key wouldn't be releasing anytime soon 
So we don't really know what's going to be going on in 2015 because I don't really think Kingdom Hearts 3 is going to come out anytime soon either. I think that's much after probably 2016 and I would actually want to be in 2016 because I don't want to be playing a rushed game. And I know uh, you, uh, some of you guys have commented that it's not rushed, that it's been in development for 4 years. But I don't think you guys understand is that development isn't pretty that fast. 4 years, yes it is a lot but development doesn't start right away with the... Um, uh, designing and the game itself. There's a thinking process, there's a thought process. It takes a year or something to get all the ideas set up and then they start the development. And it takes a while to get all your assets started. So for y the people who've been saying that it's been development for four years, that's not really saying anything because you can't really finish the game in four years, especially the games that are coming in now, which are for next gen releases. So yeah, Kingdom Hearts Key, we don't know what's gonna happen. It not being canon is really um, pissing off a lot of fans and that interview in general that came out a few days ago was pissing off a lot of fans with the information gave, they gave, especially with the Frozen thing. But I'll uh, let you guys know my opinion about the Frozen video in the interview video I posted. So yeah, that's basically what I wanted to say. Um, this discussion video was pretty fun. I am actually recording this video a, a different way than what I usually do. So it might sound better or it might sound worse. You guys comment down below. But it was kind of easy for me to record and it would allow me to do faster editing. So yeah. That's really all I want to say. Hope you guys enjoyed this video and comment down below and give it a like if you guys want me to do more of these discussion videos so you guys could have more of my opinion and you guys could know uh, what side I stand by on a certain topics. And remember, you guys can always comment on my... Shit. <laughs> so these are the type of mistakes I'm talking about that I'm going to keep in. So you guys can always comment down below uh, what topics I can talk about of Kingdom Hearts. So right now this was Kingdom Hearts Key being canon. If there's any other recent topics that came up in news that you want me to talk about, remember to drop it down in the comments below. And most likely I will be talking about it. So thank you guys for watching. I really appreciate all the love you guys have been giving to me. Um, so I'm going to be starting school soon. So remember that my videos are going to be getting a little bit scarce. So maybe two videos a week, which is really low. But I don't know. We'll see. Maybe in better days, it'll be three days a week. And uh, there may be three or four day uh, videos a week, depending on the news that comes out. Because news is totally unpredictable. So yeah. So that's basically what I want to say. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. And remember to subscribe, share, comment, like. And the possibilities for Kingdom Hearts Unlimited. Later. Thank you.